All right, so now let's move on to mission two, I suppose. Uh, no. Oh, fuck it. The game's just like pick pick a fucking gun, so I'll pick one. The male suspect in the Jameson type body that the major apprehended was put to cyber brain death by an unknown assailant. After reconstructing his fragmented memories, we determined that the man was Takaru Fuwa. Wait, you mean the victim of the university murder case five years ago? Correct. What the heck is a guy who's supposed to have been dead for five years doing in me, huh? Kazu uncovered records indicating that Fuwa had hired a courier to deliver cargo of some sort. Terrifying as we speak. According to current reports from our intelligence, his present location is between the 21st and 24th floors of the Pier Oh Martin. yes, we don't take on the Major this time. Lazo, infiltrate the garage with two touch phones. Intercept this courier and take him into custody. Roger. Okay, kids, I'll come at him from below. You two come in from above. Roger that! Just leave it to us! The security system inside the parking structure has been overwritten by someone. I need to track down the perp so we can't rewrite the system yet. Exercise extreme caution. Yeah, yeah. All right, so now we're playing as Bato. It switches between the two every now and then. I think it's every other level. I want to say it's every other level. I believe that multiple hostiles have infiltrated the parking garage. Don't let your guard down. Roger. Oh, the major is more agile and much faster than Bato. Uh, I think Bato makes up for that with his uh, actual health, but I don't think that'll matter much in this difficulty. And I've actually only I've completed this game uh, twice. So, I should tell you my experience with this game. Uh, recently I've played it, so, so I was actually able to get my damn hands on the damn game. Rock and roll. Boots to the screen and whatnot. That elevator's out of commission now. Use your own two feet. If you get a parking pass for level 22, the gate should open. Look around for a terminal. Ain't exactly what I call convenient. That's what they get for playing with dangerous toys. They're tightening security to buy some peace of mind. What matters is that nothing's stolen. Okay. Any machine? No. Anyway, Bato has a little, he has a dodge roll as well, but his isn't as good as the Major's. Because she can actually clear quite a bit of objects. There's a possibility that the guard robot security program was overridden. The security system in the pier is the same program. Anyway, it looks like this one's been overridden too. Now, boss man, we'll just have to make a do roll. Tachkoma, how's it going up top? I'm engaging the enemy! You have no choice then. See what you can do on your own. Roger. I'm gonna make sure to pick up all the damn ammo that I can get, because there there will be some instances where I will run the fuck clean out of ammo. Uh hopefully I can make it through this without having that problem though. fan there, but on my way back, I guess I found one. Yeah, uh, obviously going out there, we will, I think we'll have like one instance where we actually have to go ahead and do that, but <sighs> obviously it's not a good idea. Uh, I went that way, and there was nothing over there, and my melee is, uh, punches. <laughs> But it doesn't do anything. And considering all the stuff that they do in anime where they just kind of, you know, blow shit apart. <laughs> you can't really do much of that here. Alright. Get a parking pass from this level's terminal. Yep, Double. yep, yep, yep. Which I 
thought I was should have been able to see it like right off the bat. I think uh, this is it. There we go. That should enable you to head on up. We just gotta make sure we keep an eye out for those if it's necessary. Which I do believe they wind up being necessary, except they'll be harder to get to. Alright, so let's clear through this. And hopefully, this game is actually not that long. The thing is, is that I just need to be careful. More or less, but I'm gonna try and blow through this game as quickly as possible. So we can actually move on to the next game. Yes. Oh shit. It seems to be the very same group from the pier. They're being controlled by orders sent from higher up. Take out the commander and they'll be mere puppets. That motherfucker had a grenade launcher. It's the same thought pattern as the group on the pier. You say uh, I could sense a ghost. A puppet with a ghost, huh? I feel sorry for it. Can't I use the hacking key that the Major used? It appears to be set up so that the commander in each area controls just the AI in his own unit. Hacking keys are individually assigned. It should be easy going if we can use the enemy to... Pretty much, it, it just explained the game mechanics. Ooh. No, no, no. I'm just playing with you. Back up. I think this is access to the camera. I knew it. There are signs that the security control program was overwritten. This thing was hacked pretty deep. From what I can tell, it would be faster to control it from the server. The server? Where's that? Level 24. Alright, so we're what, on level 23? No, we're on 22. Obviously, we can't use the damn elevator. And that's the little machine that I was talking about earlier, but we don't need it. We need to get across, however. Hey, boss man. You better not pick me up. Make sure you don't do it by falling down. I don't want to hear anything from you, kid. Oh, shit. There was a dude there. Now, in most cases, we're obviously not going to be able to hack everyone, obviously, um, because of that would just make the game really easy. And usually every time we do something, the save point is activated, so. Oh yeah, that's right, we got to go back the, way, the other way. There's a fan over there. So we have to be just close enough to be able to shoot it. Uh -huh. What did I do? I activated something. Oh, it was for the door. As soon as the game lets me. If you run into the enemy there, there's nowhere to run. Proceed with extreme caution. It's fairly likely that there are surveillance cameras on level 23. See if you can enter through that terminal. Right. There's a computer there, obviously. Oh. Check it out. Got a couple of guards posted. Alright, let's head on up, because that's pretty much all we can do here. Yep. 
Fetch Toma, status. Mm. You better figure that shit out. Damn, really? What fucking bullets can you take? <laughs> we only had eight seconds anyway. We didn't have very much time to do whatever it is that we wanted to go ahead and go do. Make sure there's nothing else we gotta do on this floor. This is where the uh, the guy just kind of flopped on over and died. <laughs> so, we'll leave him alone, or leave that area alone. All right, we need to go to 23 now. this getting pretty damn ridiculous, but the funny thing is is I could just completely ignore the combat and go straight for my objective, and it ends the mission. Which I think is a little silly, but you can do it. Ooh, oh my god. Fuck. Okay, these assholes are gonna be tough. Let me see if I can just run. Damn! Caught me on the roll, too! Fuck! Sorry. That other guy got me. Come on. Oh no, 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 no. Damn, he still fucking got me. So good. They're just so good. Damn, he does. They don't care. Holy shit. Got one. Oof. Hope that made it. It did. Okay, perfect. Oh, hell yeah. Alright. Should be good to go. Fuck. Oh my god. Well. I'm good now.
guys don't need it, right? Subaru or Subaru? I don't know. I lost my damn gun. Oh, I got that stealth camo now. Let's head up. Or em oh, it's empty as shit. What the hell? Wait a fucking minute. That was the way I came in. So did I pass up the objective? I think I might have. I'll run back down there. So I think I might have just went into one giant circle. Yep, there, yep, that's where I came in. So, what am I missing here? Oh, this is where I came in. Uh, oh, actually, the mission's over. Right here. I have confirmation on the number. That's the one, all right. I guess he's an underworld delivery man. Give him enough money and the guy will deliver anything for anyone. From a single postcard to a kidnapped person. He was paid a pretty hefty sum two days ago. Try to follow the money trail. Already on it. Fua hired him. The money was deposited from a terminal in the Tohoku region. So they were trying to use a delivery service to ship misappropriated weapons. Open the cargo and we'll have our answer. Bunto, take a look and see what's inside. Okie dokie. <laughs> Alright, that was mission.